it's 7 30 in the morning august 24th this is day 23 of my trip and this will be the last trip this will be my last day for traveling i'll be home in about five hours it's a beautiful day today and i stayed the night at the bay of quinty yacht club uh courtesy of uh some friends and uh available dock space thanks to Steve Macklin being uh, off on a, on a little voyage but uh, I'll be leaving here shortly and uh, heading out back out in the Bay of Quinte west wind behind me today lots of sunshine so I'll be finishing the day up in style so quite a glare coming at us uh, <laughs> this morning and uh, Got the west wind at my back it's probably about a 10 kilometer west wind which is nice propelling me right along um, i'm now going at 8.4 kilometers an hour and just 620 watts so wind behind me that uh, really helps uh, i'm not generating much power right now let's just check and see what it is and i'm having a hard time seeing because i can't focus yet uh, I can't even see that 67 watts uh, 67 watts and, and uh, 75 watts so uh, 130 watts so about 130 watts being produced right now so not much but uh, 47 49 percent state of charge in the batteries so we've got uh, you know adequate power to get home and of course the sun will uh, the, the panels will produce more power as we get going so we're out on big bay and of course the wind and the waves are behind me very pleasant for traveling as opposed to uh, day one coming across into this west wind and the west wind was howling pretty good uh, that was a, a bit difficult so this is a nice way to finish up I'm getting close to the end of Big Bay this is actually a spot that uh, is called the Narrows and uh, ahead is the Skyway Bridge that uh, joins the mainland over to Prince Edward County uh, just west of Deseronto. Highway 49 it goes over the bridge. And behind me you can see the uh, Behind me, you can see Big Bay, and it's been just a gorgeous day. It is awesome. I couldn't have asked for a better condition. I'm getting closer to the Skyway Bridge, I'm going under that in a few minutes. Um, this will be uh, coming to the end of the Bay of Quinty on the eastern end, and. Uh, if you turn right at, at the end of the Bay of Quinty, you'll be uh, going up the Hayward Long Reach into the Adolphinstown Reach and uh, out into Lake Ontario. Um, if you turn left way up ahead, that'll be the Napanee River and that's the direction I'm going, taking me back uh, home. Now the Napanee River is not marked uh, as a navigational route even though it is. Um, so you can take a yacht right up to uh, the town of Napanee and uh, uh, stay at the town docks. Um, very few people know about this, but uh, you can do that. Uh, this bridge, the Skyway Bridge, is joins over to Prince Edward County. Uh, Prince Edward County is a fantastic place to explore. It's got lots of wineries, 
restaurants, craft breweries, sand banks, provincial park, uh, beautiful sand beaches. Um, I'll be taking my wife uh, tomorrow and we're going to head up to a little place called Lake on the Mountain. And it's a little lake that is about, I don't know, 80, 90 feet above uh, the lake surface or Lake Ontario. And from there, you have a nice restaurant, and then on the other side of the road, on the Hayward Long Reach side, you have a little pub with a patio, and you can sit out in the patio and just view for miles and miles all along the Hayward Long Reach. It's really, really nice. So, if you get a chance to visit Prince Edward County, there's lots to explore. Forester's Island and you can see the big gap between Forester's Island and the Prince Edward County side and uh, people make the mistake of going through there in their boats and there's only in some areas it's only about two feet deep so uh, yeah you're gonna hit bottom. Forester's Island uh, used to have a big mansion on it back in the late 1800s uh, and it was owned by Guy Forrester who ran uh, you know, the uh, lumbering industry in, in the area. Um, eventually it became an orphanage and uh, sometime in the early 1900s it burned down but you can still see the foundation uh, of the old mansion over there if you want to explore the island and sidewalks that uh, they had there and so all that is still there over on my left is Deseronto I lived there for 22 years it's a nice little town I quite enjoyed living there and we're coming up to the mouth of the Napanee River and this is the end of the Bay of Quinte and way in that direction, that's the Hayward Long Reach. All of that, and I'll go to Lake Ontario. So I'm about uh, an hour from home, and uh, I think I'm going to just do a little flyby on the dock, past the dock, and then circle around uh, down at the uh, town dock, which is just oh half a kilometer down from here, a kilometer down from me. Sorry, I thought that'd be a nice finish. So a cottager over at, not a cottager, but a homeowner over at the side. Uh, Anapani River here. This is out the most of Anapani River. Yeah, I just heard a shrill whistle and he was waving at me and so I waved back. So that's, uh, that's pretty good. Uh, this has been one of the, the things on this trip that's been so great just see uh, uh, people saying hi and encouraging me and watching for me uh, they go from spot to spot so it's been really fun on the Napanee River and I'm about uh, four kilometers from my dock and you can see that the river is well marked with buoys along the way uh, these don't show up on Navionics or any other uh, uh, maps or charts. But the river is uh, navigable all the way right up to Napanee. And there's town docks there and you can stay there for, uh, I think there's an overnight fee of about five bucks, something like that. Very reasonable. Uh, lots of restaurants around, waterfront restaurant right on uh, the river. Um, Lopen Ale right up on the main street. Uh, there's several others, uh, you know, the, uh, a little far to walk to, but uh, you can get to them somehow. Anyways, uh, I'll be home shortly. Well, I'm coming up to my dock. There's my son Jody and my wife Nancy waiting for me. They're going to get a video of me going by. And Chloe, our dog, is out there waiting for me as well. 
<laughs> she looks pretty excited. She's an old dog now, but she's still a sweetheart. Hey Chloe! I'm just gonna go by the waterfront and circle back. Hi Chloe! <laughs> Here is the town dock in Napanee and the waterfront restaurant. So yeah, you could uh, dock right along here. and I have uh, some wine and a uh, glass to celebrate with and uh, so I might have a little toast uh, to uh, a journey that's lasted 23 days a day sooner than my original schedule so I'm quite happy about that uh, this has been a fantastic trip I've had great support from family friends boaters along the way um, you, uh, youtubers uh, who contacted me, people on Facebook, the loopers. It's been great. Thank you very much. Cheers. Day 23, I'm back at my dock, Napanee, and uh, today has been probably a, a great, well it has been a great day, <clears throat> left at about, uh, oh I don't know, 7.30, 7.40 in the morning from the uh, Belleville Lock, uh, Yacht Club, and um, it, it's been a west wind behind me all, all day. No problems getting here. Sunny, perfect day. Got here a little after 12 noon, and uh, of course, <laughs> uh, my wife and my son were here waiting for me, and uh, they had a bottle of champagne for me, and I uh, had to have a, a drink of that, so that was fantastic. It's been an amazing adventure. That's all I could uh, describe it as. Uh, I'm so appreciative of uh, all the people that have, you know, supported me, my family and friends, <coughs> uh, of uh, all the people I met along the way, cottagers, town residents, um, boaters of, of different sorts, loopers. It's just been fantastic. And uh, even though the sun has powered my boat, I mean, your support, people's support has has supported me, you know, and uh, that kept me going. Because 23 days of uh, doing what I'm doing, and uh, it was trying at times, uh, but it's so overwhelming the the uh, support I got from everybody. Anyways, I'm going to be putting videos together uh, of the trip and uh, I'll be putting up on those links on Facebook. Um, probably not for another week and that, but uh, hopefully I could capture the essence of what I've done uh, in those videos. Great, thank you very much. Mm -hmm.